assuming that you have the assembly language program as shown. The program is assembled and is ready to be loaded to the processor code memory. This is how the codes are allocated to the code memory. The program counter, or PC, is a register in the processor that keep track of the execution of the program in the processor system. It holds the address of the next instruction to be executed. The PC is zero when the 8051 is initialized. The processor goes to code location 0000, 0, 0, 0 to fetch the instruction code the code 02 hex is fetch the pc is incremented by 1 this code is not a complete instruction the processor needs to fetch more code. The PC is now at 0001. The processor fetch the next code from code location 0001. The code is 00, zero hex. The PC is increment by 1. This instruction is not complete. The processor needs to fetch more code. The PC is 0002. The processor goes to code location 0002 to fetch the next code. The code 50 hex is fetch. The PC is incremented by 1. This is a valid instruction, and the processor will decode this instruction. This instruction actually means jump to the location labeled main. This can be seen from the assembly instruction. The location to jump to is 0050 which is actually coded in the machine instruction 020050. After the processor decodes the instruction, it changes the PC to 0050. The first instruction has been executed. The processor is ready to fetch the next instruction. The processor will fetch the next instruction from the code location 0050. The code C3 hex is fetch. The PC is increment by 1. The PC becomes 0051. The instruction is complete. This instruction actually means clear. See? This can be seen from the assembly instruction. The instruction is decoded and executed. The instruction does not involve any jump, and therefore, there will be no further changes to the PC. The processor is ready to fetch the next instruction. The processor will fetch the next instruction from code location 0051. The next code is 74 hex. 
the PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is not complete. The processor needs to fetch more code. The processor fetch the next code from code location 0052. The PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is complete and can be decoded as move immediate 20 hex 2 8. This instruction does not involve jump and the PC remains at 0053. The processor is ready to fetch the next instruction. Where is the next code? The next code is at location 0053. The PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is not complete. The processor needs to fetch more code. The next code to be fetched is at code location 0054. The PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is not complete. The processor needs to fetch more code. The next code to be fetched will be at code location 0055. The PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is complete and can be decoded as move immediate 31 hex 2 beep. This instruction does not involve jump and the PC remains at 0056. The next code is to be fetched at code location 0056. The PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is complete and can be decoded as multiply A B. This instruction does not involve jump and the PC remains at 0057. The next code is to be fetched from code location. 0057. The PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is not complete. The processor needs to fetch more code. The next fetch is at code location, as indicated by the PC. The PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is not complete. The processor needs to fetch more code. The processor fetch the next code at location 0059. The PC is incremented by 1. This instruction is complete and can be decoded as long jump main. This is a jump instruction and the jump location is coded in the machine code as 0050. The processor changes the PC to 0050. Can you follow? the sequence of the operation. Codes are fetched from code locations indicated by the program counter.
every byte of code fetch will increment the program counter the processor will decode the instruction when the instruction codes fetch are complete the processor will adjust the program counter if it is a jump instruction If the instruction is not a jump instruction, the program counter is not adjusted. Let's start all over again with the PC at 0000. The instruction fetch cycle. Program counter increment for every fetch. Decoding the instruction. Instruction is incomplete. Fetch cycle. Program counter incrementing. Decoding. Incomplete instruction. Fetch cycle. Program counter incrementing. Decoding. Execute. Fetch cycle program counter incrementing decoding executing instruction fetch program counter incrementing decoding incomplete instruction fetch Program counter incrementing decoding executing fetch program counter incrementing decoding incomplete instruction fetch program counter incrementing decoding Incomplete instruction. Fetch. Program counter. Incrementing. Decoding. Execution. Instruction. Fetch. Program counter. Incrementing. Decoding. Execution. Fetch. Program counter incrementing decoding incomplete instruction fetch program counter incrementing decoding incomplete instruction fetch program counter incrementing decoding execution Can you follow the sequence of the operation?